time. It's Nancy with She's Got Yarn. This is a good angle. You can't see the mess beyond here. <laughs> oh, goodness. I can destroy a room in five minutes. Anyways, yesterday I found a box out in the rain. <laughs> it was Michael's yarn. It was in a bag. Anyways, I opened it yesterday. I couldn't wait. But I got some of the new yarn, and it's pretty. I didn't get everything I ordered. I ordered three colors. I thought, okay, I'm going to be good, okay? And I ordered three colors. Let's see. I'm trying to download it, upload a video. It's not working. I'm going to have to. My internet's, my internet's, my internet's not up. Um. Michael's, Michael's app. Let's see, go to the house. Online, 30% off on all regular price purchases. Watch everything be on sale. Free shipping on orders above $49. Okay. Yeah. It says I got stuff in my basket. This doesn't surprise me. Yeah. Uh, hey, come here. What did you just take out of the garbage? Come here, Maverick. Come. He dropped it. What do you got? Go get it. Go get it. Oh, get it. Bring it here. Let me see. I want to see. Come here. Let me see. He's not listening. Let me see. It's a ball band. Okay. I guess it's okay. He's happy now. He's wagging his little tail. My shy. My shy lab. Anyways. I don't have the prices because I don't. I want to say I paid $6.99 a scheme. I don't know why, but I, I feel like that's what I paid. Um, I don't know why, but I can't load my order. It did not come with a receipt, but I did get some. They've never sent this kind of um, packing. That'll be nice for something I need to send out. Anyways, you guys know during Boggy Creek times, I like to use the... Um, thicker yarn. Well, this is a super bulky and Lala is wanting to knit a sweater, but I got a feeling this is too busy with a super bulky. Do y'all think that's too busy to knit a sweater? But anyways, this yarn is so pretty. It's loops and thread acrylic blend melage de acrylic it's 163 yards a number six bulky six bulky it's 96 acrylic four percent polyester wash on delicate do not bleach tumble dry at a very low heat and on delicate cycle do not iron or press do not dry clean the color is called art article Wait, no. The color is Article. I guess. That's a weird name. It says Tranquil Multicolored Paceable. Made on February of 2023. 163 yards, 6 ounces, 149 meters, 170 grams. But that's what it kind of looks like worked up. That might be a pretty top knitted. So, you don't know, but I got three, four, five, six, seven. You know, the other one, I think I got eight. The other one, I want to say may, it might have been a lavender of some sort. I can't remember. Isn't that pretty though? 
Anyways, I like working working up number six in boggy blankets, but this is intended for, and I shouldn't have, you know, I, I got it. So I'm going to make, I'm going to knit. It's a knit challenge. No guarantees. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I got eight. So I got six of the other. I remember I ordered like, no, seven of one color and eight of another. So yeah, I got eight of these. So, but aren't they pretty? I think they're so pretty. And I hope the knitting turns out like that. How pretty. That looks really pretty. So. All right. The next new yarn. I only got two of the, I think I got two colors of this. One color's on back order. Or they canceled it. I don't know. And then loops and thread. Y'all, I ordered some yarn for 59 cents. I never got. But they never sent me a cancellation. I need to look into that. Anyways, this next color's um, article number. Okay, so they don't name their colors. Tahitian Teal. Ta Tahitian Teal. Number five, bulky. This kind of reminds me of crystal cake, but it's also, it's, it's got several different types. It's got a thin strand in here and it's fuzzy. Then this is like the crystal, it's shiny. But then it's got like, like a hairy, almost like a latte cake type strand in it. And then a strand with some white running through it. But, you know, when I was looking at when Ginger was touching it, I imagined it to be heavier. It's not that heavy. I want to say it's kind of light. U.S. $9.99, but you guys know I got 30% off. Okay. And maybe this one has a price. Oh, I didn't tell you. This recommended an 8 millimeter crochet hook. But, um. No. It doesn't have a price on here. It doesn't have a price. It's so pretty. And it's so soft. I think this would make a very beautiful sweater. Alright, back to this. This is soft too. But this looks like it would not be fun to frog. It kind of reminds me of the crystal cakes that I have a ton of. And that's what it looks like crocheted. So. I wonder what it would look like knitted. I bet it'd be prettier than that. Do new. But I got, how many did I get? I got two three, four, five. Yeah, it's still thinking. I got five of these and they are five bulky acrylic, 67 acrylic, 7% metallic, 12% polyester and 11 nylon, six and a half millimeter need knitting needle, USK. Um, Two hundred twenty-six yards, so four fifty-nine, so a thousand yards. So, not sure what I'll use that for, but I do have plans for this one, and I have another one this color. I mean, another type. I, I have this type of yarn in another color. I think it was lavender, but I can't pull it up because I still don't have internet. And I don't know why, but it's not letting me use my hotspot. Oh, now, there you go. Home.
rewards shop project save for later your cart so frustrating it won't let me go into the house darn anyway that was my haul i um i hope you enjoyed that i can't wait but before i start this i gotta finish that blanket i'm i'm good with thick yarn i i can knit better with thick yarn but i have so much to do so much to keep my brain my brain busy so I don't stop and think about the sad things in my life. But we're all doing okay. I miss her so much. And um, for new subscribers, if you don't know, I had this amazing yellow lab. Her name was Marley. And um, we lost her last week or the other day. And um, my world, it rocked my world. But I'm... I'm trying to look at the bright side and be grateful for the time that I had with her because she was a really cool dog. And anybody who met her loved her. <laughs> she made you love her. <laughs> if you didn't pet her, she would better pet me. <laughs> the vet was telling me she kept grabbing her arm <laughs> when she was... I had this vet, the vet that took care of her. She wanted to try to save her. She ha she really wanted to... She tried hard and she took Marley home and she told me that Marley insisted that she pet her she would paw at her so she had a couple good days there and then she just took a turn for the worst and I didn't want her to suffer she had a embolism of the spinal cord so and if she had some movement in her back end we probably could have maybe saved her, but she lost total, total, she needed total care. Like, could not walk, couldn't control anything. I can't lift her. I couldn't care for her. And a lot of people are like, well, why don't you get wheels for it? That is all, that's, that's easier said than done. It really is. You have to train the dog, you know. I could see her flipping out with that thing under her. And I have more than one dog if I had just her to work with, but I got a pack of dogs here. And I didn't give up on her. She gave up. She was ready. So, but I know you guys understand that. Everybody that has messaged has told me they understand that. And But it's, it's, a, it's a tough pill to swallow, you know, when you have to make a decision like that. Especially an animal that you love dearly. And you know she loved your grandbabies. I have some of the cutest videos. I can't find them. Um, when Kirkland was little, when she was like three, I used to buy her cowboy boots every week. I spoiled her rotten. And I'd buy her a dress, a skirt, and she'd wear those boots. Anyways, she was walking around the yard with this little plastic rake. And Marley would follow her around. And she'd turn around and she'd scratch Marley on her back with the rake. And Marley was just like, oh. She'd hug Marley and kiss her. Marley kiss her. I mean, she was just really, really good with children. She was loving, you know. Um, Gunner, she was a little scared of Gunner. Because he can be mean. But she, she still would kiss on him. But, yeah. I'll probably talk about her all the time. So, I don't want to forget her. So, alright guys. I am... I think I'm done. I'm looking at a pile of yarn I need to drag back in that bedroom. Yep, I got a lot of work cut out for me. But I'll have fun. It'll keep me busy. Keep my mind busy. And uh, again, thank you for all your uh, thoughts and prayers. And um, regarding Marley and the storm. Uh, um, for all of us here in Florida. Um, it sounds like Bree over in Jacksonville is doing okay. Um, she sounded more concerned for me. Um, the sky is beautiful right now. The sun is out. Yeah. Y'all want to see? I'll show you. Of course. 
course, the sun was shining just a second ago. But see, look at the blues. There's clouds on it. It's a blue sky. Very pretty. So that's behind that cloud there. Look at how pretty that sky is. Um, it doesn't look too bad. I didn't lose any trees. Everyone wants to come out. Well, here is. I came out here just to show you. It didn't look too bad. The driveway doesn't look too bad. And we, you know, we uh, we do have a dead pine tree over there. Tim, his, his little side-by-side -side is my garbage can. <laughs> got a dirty nose. He's got sugar on his nose. Got whipped cream. <laughs> oh. All right, guys. You got monkey eyes. You got monkey eyes. Yes, you got clacker's eyes. Look at those eyes. You got such pretty black eyes. Look at Give me kissy. Can I have kissy? Huh? Can I have you kissy? Give me kissy. Give me kissy. Mm. Heck. This is all I got left. These colors of that latte cake and then this. So I need another cake of this color in that sequence. I don't know why, but this light makes this power thing hot. See, I got a power, I got a new lamp right there. And I can put my camera on there and I'm going to try to do a tutorial. We'll see. We will see. Y'all, this summer, I did not go out in the sun at all. My legs are painfully white. Ooh, I cut my leg today. Oh, I cut it in a couple places. That blood thinner, I believe, real easy. <sighs> you guys, I did something really funny. Hey, everyone. It's Nancy with She's Got Yarn. How's everybody doing? Well, today, I did something. It was kind of naughty. But it was harmless. Um, my neighbors next door, they're dogs. I don't know what's wrong with them, but I can't have a conversation outside my door here. They bark. They bark the entire time. Well, I went outside to make a phone call because I'm having issues with getting signal. Anyways, I'm standing outside, you know, doing this with my phone. I look up. And my neighbor staring out her her back door, and she lets her dogs out, and they aim. They come straight to me. Three of them. And I thought that was intentional. So, anyways, I've never said anything except to myself. You know, um, the husband has said, "You know, I'm so sorry." I'm like. 
it is what it is. You know, I've never been rude or anything, except one time I was, I was frustrated. I was working on my truck and they barked the whole time I washed my truck. So I turned around and I squirted them with the hose. She caught me. <laughs> I didn't harm them, okay? I just want them to shut up and leave me alone. Well, anyways, I think I made her mad. So she kind of lets her dogs out when I'm out there, I think, to annoy me. So anyways, I thought to myself, what can I do to, so they'll leave me alone? And I thought of, I'm going to, I googled sounds that dogs hate. <laughs> Y'all, it worked. I didn't say a word. <laughs> I laughed so hard. My husband said, I can't stand that noise. I can't imagine the dogs, but I want y'all to hear it. I turned this on. It didn't take two seconds, and they were running, and they were looking back like, is that sound going to follow me home? Yeah. Consider going solar in watch this. Watch this. Some of you might not think it's funny, but it's like, it's ridiculous how annoying these dogs are. They took off. Zeus is hard of hearing. Maverick's going. <laughs> they took off. That was hilarious. They took off. They didn't bother me anymore. There's a second sound. Y'all, what a great idea. The next one is... Number three, animals howls and growls. The YouTube pages and beats. <laughs> what do you think's next? I don't know why I didn't think of this sooner. Other dogs barking. But number one took they took off, so I don't know if the others would work. But they hated that high frequency. I'm like, awesome. So I'm gonna use that so they stop maybe it'll train them. Cause like if I have a service guy. My dog's a dead in face. Navi, what is that? What are you doing? <laughs> he doesn't care. <laughs> okay. You guys got the gist of it. I won that battle, and I didn't have to say a word. <laughs> oh gosh, that was funny. That was a that was good on my part. <laughs> Y'all know I love dogs, but these dogs are really annoying. I mean, I can't go outside and have a conversation. They just bark the whole time. I can't do a video, you know. But it worked. For sure. But she does put him inside sometimes, which is good. She used to leave him out all the time. But, but I'm... That was so funny. I had to get on here and share that with y'all. Um, I don't have anything new going on. I haven't accomplished a whole lot. Maverick's got a piece of paper that has important stuff on it. That dog, he loves paper. Anyways, I just wanted to share that with you guys. I love you all.